wants to be. It's a Penske. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. How did that happen? The yellow had been out for some time. Jacques Villeneuve got high coming through three, up into the gray, and absolutely rammed into one of those stationary cars. The yellow flags are out everywhere. We've got several cars damaged. We'll keep track of this, and when we come back, we'll let you know exactly what's happened here. Debris all over the third and fourth turn. Back at the Slick 50 200 Phoenix, Arizona, you see the damage to Villeneuve's car. We've got several cars involved here. A chain reaction accident, actually several separate accidents, all occurring in the same place at about the same time. Fortunately, all the drivers, including Paul Tracy, who was the leader of the race involved, and Jan is right there. Paul, what happened out there? Well, I, I, coming down the back straightaway, and I saw a Hero and somebody and, and, and Bobby get together, and they just went up the track. I was up on the outside, and I had nowhere to go, and then I was sitting there. I was about to get out of the car, and something hit me. I don't know if somebody's... Somebody's motor just clobbered me right in the side. Well, that's something right, was Phil Ness. Yeah, Look here. Me out of the race. Well, thankfully, you're okay. It was a scary moment. Yeah, it was. Thank you, Paul. I'll tell you what. Hero is a very lucky man. Let's take a look at it again, Derek. Here's how it starts. Teo Fabi right there. Touches wheels with Matt Schuster. That is an accident all by itself. Watch Tracy. Now stop it right there. Can we stop it right there? Tracy tries to avoid it. And look, he's in the gray. Okay, if we let it run on, you'll see what happens then. Tracy is an innocent victim here. Now it's a three-car crash. As soon as it all stops, remember the gray is the no-grip area. 